Shalom guys, I hope that you are doing well. I'm just here to do a general reading for us. So it's just kind of one of those lazy Sundays. And so I hope that you are enjoying your day and all of that. If you are returning, I appreciate you all. Thanks for returning as often as you do. And those of you who are new, my name is Shannon and I'm glad to have you. Um, my channel can be very intense. I could come across church and religious. I'm just for the truth, man. And the truth comes by the scripture, which is found in the tarot. And so it's honored here and I seek my father in heaven in truth and so it could come across real heavy that way but I'm just I'm just this is a work that I do and um, the truth is the truth is the truth okay and so we look at all kinds of stuff like criminal activity and, and stuff like that that could you know be influencing your life my life it could you know just some, something could just be around you that you just need to know about and um, so whatever comes out we just let the great one bring it out um, I love you Jehovah Elohim maker of heaven and earth he is all that I search for and I love his son which walked among us in the flesh in the earth and so I kiss his son and I'm not ashamed of him and so this is who I am and take it or leave it you you get all kinds of sides of who I am I don't have anything to prove to anyone I just get on my channel sometimes just any old way and so it, I feel energy and sometimes it could come across real heavy and sometimes it is may, might sound goofy to you if it is I guess it is <laughs> it is what it is and so sometimes I could roar at energy as well just uh, I just feel the energy of, of what Yehovah is bringing through me and how he's feeling about a matter and so stuff like that so um anyway if you stay great if not and thanks for checking me out happy birthday happy anniversary and all that with that said let's get started all right thank you Jehovah, for clear to find messages you have a rebuke and bind and block every foul wicked dark energy and shove it on down to the pit of hell where it belongs i just thank you for this day Jehovah, and i just inquire at your hand and your hand alone i appreciate you and who you are in our life and how you go before us and prepare the way and um, make every crooked place straight. Order our steps today, Yehovah, by your word and your word alone. Every foul, wicked, dark, nasty, disgusting, perverted, seducing energy, doctrines of demons, we just come against you. Yehovah, rebuke you. We plead the blood of Yeshua, the Hamashiach, against you. Thank you, Yehovah. Yehovah's going to heal something that got really bad. And somebody's went through some real hardcore stuff out here. And Yehovah says he's going to heal something. And that's positive. And there ain't nothing too hard for him. You just go through your process and be willing to look from within. Then, um, then great. And there's somebody that has been in fear and turning in fear. And um, yesterday we had a scripture that came out that stated that you know, whoever digs a pit and rolls a stone away, they themselves will, you know, that stone in that pit, they'll fall in it and it'll roll back up on themselves. And so whatever's out here where some type of uh, situation has went down, it's gotten really bad. Somebody's been through some type of uh, situation that it was so fearful. And uh, if you let Jehovah just um, cover you, he'll give you an anointing of peace. Um, the the cuff is here, which is a justice card in the Hebrew. It's the letter K. It came out in my other reading today. It means to bend and or to curve or to tame or subdue. Uh, it could, you know, it's it's a justice card. So if you're dealing with legal matters and you're dealing with legal matters, somebody's gonna be bent and cuffed and subdued and bent to uh, go to jail, I guess. Um, Otherwise, if you're just energetically going through something that's just been really hardcore in your spirit, this is an anointing to, to break a yoke. This is some type of a suppression against We had the devil show up twice today. Uh, and the moon was there. Big time stuff was there. There's a judgment here with the letter cuff. The letter K could be prevalent. Doesn't have to be. Person, place, or a thing. First, middle, last name, an object, a street name, whatever. Um, let's bring that out here for you. But that's about the truth and completeness something is over here okay which means shalom peace we have fear and we have peace out here we have an anointing to break a yoke of fear and we have something out here about healing something that got really bad okay it's somebody was playing games and something happened around some type of game or maybe you play games there's pool there's golf there's baseball football soccer hockey um 
basketball written on that card. Okay, so something went down. Something, somebody got hurt. Somebody did something. The other day I did a reading and the, something about baseball bats, you know, were, were, were coming out within some stupidness where somebody apparently got in some type of a fight or something like that. Somebody paid somebody off to do something. It's just crazy. Yehovah stated, um, had me write down on one of my cards that somebody who was taking, and actually right before I went to bed last night, I heard him say it. He brought that card that he had me write down the information on that um, the person who uh, is taking a bribe to do what, the bribe is about to go do something wicked. However, it's written on the card that that person's going to meet the exact same thing that they took that bribe to do. So whatever they did, uh, they're going to fall into the same. Somebody's going to do that to them. Somebody's going to do that to them. That's 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 something else, man. Jehovah gives a space of forgiveness. You don't take that space when you're hearing, oh my gosh, what I do, or your your conscience is still going off, and then if you don't do it, your conscience gets seared, and then you're just locked into that place of being seared. And uh, if you, if you, you know, will listen today and face the truth, if you still can hear, Jehovah will break this yoke off of you and take away your fear and give you this shalom, whatever this is. Maybe you play a professional sport. I'm not sure. We have the knight in shining armor. The knight of cups is here. This is about being fair. This is also a law card. This is somebody real dreamy. All right. This is, um, we got the ego. So the devil does want to be seen today. He really wants to be seen today. He came out on the floor. Hold on a minute. <laughs> we have the devil. We also have the empress. We have legal matters out here because the Empress also represents that. I had like three cards that fell on the floor, so just give me a second, please. And the sun. Obviously, the devil goes back to I'm conceited. This is pride and ego and everything else. I had to pause my camera for a second. So we have um, a lot of pride then that would be out here. And the Empress, like I said, she has the justice skills within her. So that we got legal matters. She can represent a boss. The, the, the um, devil card is also a boss. But if somebody's going to heal something within something that got really bad, uh, then for some people that's here. Otherwise, there's still a predator around. Somebody's going to be, you know, cuffed. If somebody's going to be cuffed so that you can heal something, then that's here. We got children. We got um, love and romance. We've got the Empress represents somebody who's beautiful. And uh, this person, it, this energy has a counterpart. So if you're dealing with your wife or you're dealing with your mother or your grandmother, she's got all four queens within her. She's somebody that could be known. Industry, somebody that's known. And friends stage somebody's like really known here for some people this is empires and this is some somebody of worth if they're in the upper otherwise if this person's a predator and they're out of balance and there's something about pregnancy issues out here uh and somebody just got a lot of pride and ego around some situation at work uh or, or around something then then something's here somebody did real dreamy if this empress is showing up like a knight then they're immature, okay? They're, they're childish. They're just, look at me. I'm so beautiful, and we don't care that you're beautiful because you're stupid if you're if you're just showing up like a knight. Somebody, again, but there is energies out here of being fair. This is divine grace in the upright of the devil card, something just real hardcore somewhere because something got bad. This piercing energy because somebody was real big prideful and real big conceited uh, in some situation. We have projects out here. We definitely have the industry out here. We definitely do. We have the temperance card coming out here. And this is, you know, if you're dealing with the stuff that's taking place where somebody got, you know, killed then then you are this is eternity in the hebrew this is somebody trying to get their balance something right up in front of somebody's face here in this reading and uh, again being uh, you know cuffed and getting you know set free this card in the hebrew represents a salvation a deliverance 
also, you know, we've got the anointing over here. This goes back to a prophet. And Jehovah says, you don't touch my prophets. You don't do them no harm. You will bring a strike straight from Elohim if you do that, man. Um, somebody hasn't been unbalanced, sex, drugs, rock and roll, or somebody's dealing with some type of chain where their ex and uh, exes and divorces are here with this, or somebody's high on drugs all the freaking time. Um, just because they're dreamy don't mean crap, man. Um, if they're, they don't have no value, you always said, you know, especially the, the Empress, if she's in the negative, my God, she is just nothing but a beautiful person. Like the, the scripture stated the other day, when I, yesterday when I did a reading, she's just a pig, man. She looks like a pig in the side of Jehovah and all she got some beautiful jewel in her nose. That's it. All right. Somebody needs to be delivered from some type of, uh, person out here in the negative of this energy like that. Okay whatever that is show me this um show me this night we have a person card out here but again we do have law this also a law card law 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 and then the justice card even the sun can go back to law because i can go back to government what is this night out here for you what do you want to bring out here about this night could be pregnancy issues out here the cup is there What's this night here for you? Hold on. The Queen of Swords. Well, if that's law, somebody's ripping somebody's freaking mask off. If that's somebody's ex that you're dealing with, has just been like, I'm restraining you from everything because they're just a freak, then that's here. Or somebody's upright, able to take somebody's mask off there. Um, there's the little lover card here. Somebody thought that sex was going to buy them what they wanted in some ordeal because there was a seducing energy. I think the same house holds this deck here in the card uh, in the tarot. Uh, somebody's teenager could be here. This could be, you know, baby mama wars if this is your ex and it's a mother and you got another baby coming or something like that's happened or something's happened around some type of business because we had a business come out. This uh, if Somebody gave a favorable testimony to something because the page of, of uh, wands is a favorable testimony. We got somebody then that, who could uh, rip off the mask and put a judgment on something and then some something would be overthrown because this, this, this can turn out bright. There's a deliverance out here. You're always going to heal some stuff. If somebody else got to go to jail, like I said, something just being turned just like that. Okay? It's just crazy. Because something was traded here with the three of wands. You always give me some more words out here, please. You just pick it. I just thank you for, for how profound you are. No, we got children out here. This is a new generation as well. This is also the sperm in the Hebrew, okay? If somebody's trying to seduce somebody uh, that even works for the law, and I just know that to be the case because I've already talked about it on the channel. We got we got people trying to lure in children, and that ain't that ain't cool, man. That just ain't cool. This person needs to be taken out of society. They're a freak. We got we got you know occultism here with with the, with Satan. Okay, we got a Satanist out here. That ain't cool, man. That ain't cool. Uh, something about study is here. We had a school and education and students come out in a reading it, it, this morning. It came out last night on a very profound um, personal reading. If those of you who caught that, and there was there was all kinds of ropes and stuff out there. Uh, so, somebody, this is I still I kill I destroy because I'm so prideful in my own freaking eyes and I think this sperm of mine can 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 um, get me whatever I want because I'm unbalanced I think sex if I just give you a little hey baby uh, because I'm cute I think it's gonna get me what I need and, and somebody gonna be cuffed okay if somebody's dealing with somebody that either you went to high school with or college or you need to watch your children around some idiot or your teenager is is here this fire this passion okay and somebody hopefully somebody's given a, a report here that's upright to, to, to restrain the devil and get him into jail or him or her whoever the crap this is somebody's boss there was a company that's bound in some stupidness something gonna be forced here right up in your face you are protected if you're in the upright you keep in commandment with you all the divine timing is here on something 
and uh, somebody, you know, is going to be healed from something, but you're going to have to go slow. You think you're just going to jump in there and go, hey, we got this person taken care of or whatever, and you are upright, you're going to have to go slow with somebody. It's going to take time for some people to heal because something's really went down a very bad way. You always said it got real bad over here. Um, angels are, you're entertaining angels unaware, Yehovah says. Okay, so we got fallen entities in the earth. We got people that are infiltrated with demonic entities. They've had openings because their heart has been pierced with some stupidness. The devil is a fallen entity. We have scripture about that stuff. And some people have been entertaining angels unaware. And it's time to understand that they, they are also here to help us. You know, the devil and his angels are fighting against Michael and his angels. And Michael stands for the people of Jehovah, just like we're told in the book of uh uh, Daniel, we had the material world. Well, that's what this crap is. This is rich and generous out here with the uh, Empress with the projects and stuff like this. So the material world is here. And some people, they let they have the love of money and they're evil. All right. So um, if you're dealing with somebody who's kind of gothic, then that's out here. We also have the, the trumpet is being blown. This goes back to talking about from, um, from the city, there's a sounding of a trumpet. Uh, as an alarm of an invasion in the inhabitants of the surrounding fields and villages of, of yards. And uh, there's some, for some type of protection, there's a walled city type of energy here. But there's a trumpet being blown out. That's just energetically, it's just energetically, if something's really going down in an area, then there's an invasion here. All right. We also have something connected to blue eyes, or you have blue eyes, or some, some type of connection to blue eyes. Um, a traveling and a journey energy is here. And it also goes back to uh, like a spiritual journey and walking a certain type of lifestyle in truth, people, in truth. Um, a protective covering is also here. Well, we got you're protected as well. And there's 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 something huge out here then today. Uh, is somebody going to be bent and cuffed, take to jail? Then great. Thank you, Yehovah. And somebody says, whatever you need, it's all right with me and I want to care for you and you just need to go slow with this person. Somebody's been hiding in the dark because they've been so... Uh, sad on whatever's went down with the stupidness that's been out here. Beware of strange energy around you today and pay attention. Jehovah says, yes, because you're entertaining angels, unaware people. Some people aren't who they who you think they are. Okay? We know that angels can appear in this realm. It's, it, obviously, people, you are uh, spiritual or you wouldn't be listening to this message. Okay? Um, the book of revelations we have a church organization that is involved in a situation if that's a company and that's bound together then that would take us back to angels and i'll prove it to you in the book of revelation christ is holding the seven stars in his hands okay the seven clusters of stars i got makeup underneath my finger now the seven clusters of stars uh in the book of revelation is the palladians in the book of Job, um, we have writings that state who can um, uh, who can buy or something about the the Palladians being very influential or something like that. And I, I want to say there's something about binding there in that scripture. I'd have to look it up. And they're very influential. Okay, so we're dealing with you know if you read in the book of Revelation, Jehovah is giving word to the churches they are in the churches some i guess you know are upright some aren't i guess um but they, they give sweet binding influential stuff from their mouth okay um we had the word candy that also came out today as well because there was a seducing energy they are in the churches because the book of revelation also tells us get out of, of uh, the church because it's setting on a dragon at this point. There's a lot of fornication, sex, drugs, rock and roll, and stuff like that. People doing some unethical things. It's just the time that we live in now, people. It just is. And so if you read in the book of Revelation, uh, Christ is giving them spaces to repent 
and they're over the churches and there's you know, seven different churches there that he's addressing so we do we are dealing with people that are also infiltrated in the churches they've came into your love feast and now it's so infiltrated with just nastiness there uh that you always say you need you just need to you know be aware Okay, you need the anointing. You need to keep the covenant with Yehovah. Uh, the church setting on a dragon and the dragon going after the woman and her seed that keeps the commandment. It's the church attacking the, the, the true people of Yehovah that keeps the commandment. And we're, yet we're told that the commandment in the book of Revelation by Yeshua himself, that if you keep the commandment, you will have right to the, to the tree of life. Uh, we're told by King Solomon, you keep the commandments, your whole duty, um, that uh, no evil will, will hurt you. Okay, the, these people don't keep the commandment. They're just going in saying hallelujah. They might keep some of the commandment, but if they don't keep the Shabbat, that's our sign between us and Jehovah. It keeps us safe, people. There's church organization involved in some ordeal, okay? And there's strange energy that people need to be aware of. And there is a trumpet being blown straight from the heavens. The devil's uh, mask being taken off of him. Whatever this is. And you're going to stomp on his enemy. Because the anointing is here to bend it. His government is being set up in the earth. And it has no end. Okay. This is a force here. Um, for the upright shall dwell in the land. Who are the upright? The upright are those who are keeping the covenant with Jehovah. The, the, those people who heard the call and say, Get out of her, my people. Okay, if you're upright, you and I get to um, dwell in the land because Jehovah and Archangel Michael standing up for, for the people of Jehovah. For the upright shall dwell in the land and the perfect shall remain in it, but the wicked shall be cut off from the earth and transgressors shall be rooted out of it. This will come out for this reading until next time. Shalom.